So you want to learn about the pen tool? Let's cut the crap and get straight to the point. Open up the After Effects and wait till eternity. Done. Now make a solid, go to the top and click on the pen tool. Or just press G, remember it. G, 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 how hard is it, huh? Now click to add a point, click and hold to add a point with handles. Oh, you added a straight point but now you want it to be curved. Then just hold Alt, click and drag to bring out the handles. Click the handles to change the shape of the curve. Hold Alt and click on handle to change only one of the handles. Oh shit, this won't show you what I'm trying to say. Let's take another point. There you go, see, affecting only one side. One more thing, whenever you add a point, make sure you have the last point selected. Okay, so I guess the controls are clear to you, let's use them. Take any design, add a point, add another point, add another point, just keep adding them up. No, this is the wrong way, remember, less of the points, smoother the image. Wait a minute, does that mean you have to trace the entire shape with just two points? No stupid, just use as few points as possible. One point is affected by four handles. A handle changes shapes only on its sides. If you are making changes over here, don't expect to align it with the shape on this side. Sorry, my English is bad. Sometimes you also might need to change the location of the point. There you go, I like it. Now let's change the other side. Wow, it matches automatically. Now this doesn't always happen. One more thing, hold shift while rotating the handle to rotate in 45 degrees. This is what I exercised on. I traced the whole penguin up part by part. That was it. Now go and practice. If you found this video helpful, gently press that like button. Otherwise, every time you open up After Effects, it will crash. Now you don't want that, do you? Let's press like, it really helps, especially for the newcomers like me. Thanks, bye.